Welcome back to another episode in the Philippines. On today's episode, we will be heading to the beautiful island of Bohol. In our previous episode, we were staying on this beautiful island called Darakotan Island on the Isla Experience, but sadly it was time to say goodbye and head over to our next stop. After a quick 10 minute boat ride back to the mainland, we headed straight over to the airport to hop on a plane and head over to Bohol. We paid 10,350 pesos per person for the flights and that also included a 10 kilo check-in bag. The flight time is 1 hour and 35 minutes and it's super quick. After landing, we headed in a taxi straight to our hotel where we were staying in Lobok River Resort. If you want to see more about this amazing resort, you can see our other episode above. Despite the super rainy weather, we headed out on the moped and our first stop was the Tarsia Sanctuary. As we arrived really early in the morning, we were the first people to arrive. We paid 150 pesos per person. Unfortunately, the Tarsia is on the endangered species list. This is due to habitat loss and also them falling prey to domestic cats. But fortunately, amazing places like this exist who are doing everything they can to help the numbers recover. So we've arrived at the Chocolate Hills, we're just at the bottom and there's uh, quite a few stairs so we're just going to head up and we'll show you the view from the top. Unfortunately it was raining so much that day that I couldn't fly the drone because it was raining too much. But I did manage to get some nice shots on the GoPro. Also, Freya couldn't resist going into the gift shop and buying us both a t-shirt. The next day the weather cleared up so we headed out on the moped and went to explore some waterfalls. On our way there we stumbled across this tour guide who took us to see the waterfalls. Our tour guide also took us to see these amazing rice terraces.
In Bohol, you can also swim with the whale sharks. We decided not to though. One of the reasons being that they hand feed the whale sharks, which then messes with their natural migration route because they just get used to being fed. So if you're thinking of coming to Bohol and swimming with the whale sharks, I'd just recommend that you do your research beforehand so you can make an informed decision. Next up we headed over to the super popular Alona Beach. This is definitely one of the most touristy spots on the island compared to where we were staying in Lobok River. One thing that seemed to be very popular with the Filipino tourists was the Lobok River cruise so we went along to check it out. We paid 850 pesos for the tickets and that included a buffet lunch. Sadly this brings my trip in the Philippines to an end, but don't forget to visit my channel as I have lots of other episodes in the Philippines for you to check out. Don't forget to like, subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss the release of our next episode. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.